Today's reading is a continuation of the last discourse of Jesus in John's Gospel, and this comes from John chapter 14. Jesus said to his disciples, Peace I leave with you, my peace I give you. Not as the world gives do I give it to you. Do not let your hearts be troubled or afraid. You heard me tell you I am going away and I will come back to you. If you loved me, you would rejoice that I am going to the Father, for the Father is greater than I. And now I have told you this before it happens, so that when it happens you may believe. I will no longer speak much with you, for the ruler of the world is coming. He has no power over me, but the world must know that I love the Father and that I do just as the Father has commanded me. My friends, the gospel, the good news of our Lord Jesus Christ. Peace I leave with you, my peace I give you. Not as the world gives do I give it to you. Where do we find our peace? And how does the world give us its peace? I think for many of us, peace is the absence of violence. But how we defend ourselves against this violence can probably best be seen in how much money we spend on our defense budget, billions of dollars every year. And yet this is not the peace that Jesus is talking about. We seek security, we seek a healthy income to protect ourselves, we try to find safe neighborhoods, and yet all of this is trying to find peace through controlling our external environment. The kind of peace that Jesus offer us, offers us is not an external peace, but an interior one. A peace that allows us to feel the confidence of God's presence, even when things are not necessarily going so well. Even when we find ourselves in difficult times, when we find ourselves bereft of the things that uh, we find security in. So today let us pray for that gift of interior peace, the peace that makes us whole, the peace that unites us together with our Lord.